Hello everyone, uh, this is Andrea from VNC. Um, joining with me is uh, Ben. We are very happy to be here in the OWNPL conference uh, 2021 and we will be talking about our help, help chart integration uh, or development for and with own cloud. Just one quick word, who are we? Um, VNC Lagoon is a suite of integrated communication and collaboration products which is available on-prem and also in private or public clouds. And you can guess what that means for deployments. And um, we have spent um, the recent two years um, with um, migrating all our applications and products to Kubernetes. So Ben will tell you <laughs> something about that. And um, as own cloud is an um, important part for us in our VNC Lagoon product suite for file sync and share, that created the need to um, think about um, having that also on Kubernetes. So that was just from my side. Um, and let me to the next slide and hand over to Ben. Thank you very much, Andrea. Yeah, so I'm Ben Neal and um, I'm part of the DevOps team at VNC. Uh, so we've really been on a kind of a, a massive journey over the past sort of six months to a year. We've uh, migrated uh, all our microservices over to Kubernetes. Um, we have a, a wide range of, of customers. So we have some that um, use on-premise, so we deploy Kubernetes to on-premise customers, but we also have customers that uh, enjoy the flexibility that public clouds bring, like uh, Q uh, Google GCP, so Google Cloud. Um, so this is one of the reasons that we, we partnered with own clouds. Uh, our customers like the portability uh, of the file syncing, as Andrea mentioned. So one thing uh, that we were looking at when we were migrating um, all our microservices over. We wanted the ability to run own cloud on-premise and in public cloud. So we, um, the, the first part of our journey was to, to try and migrate and use the uh, publicly available Helm charts. So there's a, there was a, a Bitnami Helm chart um, published uh, for own cloud, um, but it, it didn't, didn't seem to fit our purposes. So we, what we did is we, we went to work and um, adapted that own, uh, own cloud chart and uh, built our own. So now we have the confidence that we can build um, own cloud on-premise and on public clouds uh, with ease. And, and that's kind of our, our gift back to the open source community. Uh, we've published, um, which you'll see on the slide, we've published our own uh, own cloud chart, own cloud chart. So the, the way we use this is we, um, we use Flux V1. Um, so this just applies Helm releases or Kubernetes manifests. So we have our, our tailored own cloud solution. So all you have to do if you uh, use this chart is to plug in your own environment, environmental variables, and that will deploy a fully working own cloud solution on your on-premise or public cloud cluster. So yeah, we're, we're really happy with the end results and it, it's great to be continued uh, partnering with, with own cloud and using this brilliant software, um, as well as providing flexibility to our customers. So yeah, that's, um, that's our journey so far. Um, uh, back to you, Andrea. And um, thank you very much, <clears throat> Ben. So what, what do I do now um, as um, an administrator or as a DevOps when I want to deploy own cloud um, via Kubernetes, um, towards um, the cloud. <laughs> yeah, so, so if, if that's what you want to do. Um, so we, we have uh, some brilliant documentation in the repo. So if you follow the link to the repo, uh, it explains how to uh, consume the chart. Um, so you can either uh, run some commands manually for, for testing purposes, but what would, we would recommend you to do is to um, apply this in, a, in an automated fashion so what we do at VNC is we use Flux um, and we have the, the Helm release files applied. So we, we consume this chart all in a Kubernetes manifest and the deployment is, is automated. So this means if we need to make any changes, let's say we, we um, 
move uh, the backend database from, from one location to another, or we have um, new customers coming on board, we can, we, we, we've templated everything. So we can easily move um, from one cloud to another on-premise back to, to public cloud or whatever the customer's needs are. So yeah, it's, um, it's just a case of, um, it, well, it's, it's tailored to your needs. So you just need to follow the documentation and, and uh, go from there really. Very cool. So from a customer perspective, because I'm spending my time with um, conversations with customers and partners, they, um, the request for hybrid clouds um, comes more and more often. Is this something that we can also deliver with um, these, this way of deployment? Yes, absolutely. It's completely flexible. So if, if your needs are you, you can only run on-premise or you have a mixture of, of cloud and on-premise, we, we can tailor the solution to, to whatever it needs to be. There's, there's, we, we can, we've even had examples of customers where um, they, they'd like uh, VMs on-premise, but actually managed by public clouds. There's, there's some cool offerings that, that some of the public clouds offer. So yeah, it's, it's completely flexible and adaptable. That is very cool. So um, this is available for <clears throat> the today's um, live um, on cloud version. It is available um, on our GitHub um, at the link that you are seeing um, on the slide. And um, we shared it uh, publicly. And of course, we would appreciate any feedback that you might have or any questions or um, also collaboration on um, these Helm charts. And um, this uh, will be maintained um, by us and by own cloud um, together. And um, of course, we're very thankful for own cloud being available for our questions during um, that time, because there were quite a few. Um, as we know our VNC Lagoon product stack quite well, and we know our Kubernetes environments quite well, but um, with the own cloud from, from um, the code side, um, there were definitely um, questions that um, needed to be answered and uh, we're happy about that. And, um, you know, um, we have a strategic partnership with own cloud and um, are having really tighter integrations uh, product wise, which we will also talk about in five minutes <laughs> or, or less. And um, therefore for us, it was very important to um, get this automated rollout done as quickly as possible and um, to uh, make this available um, for all our worldwide partners and um, customers as um, the VNC Lagoon suite can be mixed and matched uh, for uh, implementations as they are needed. So people, um, customers may say, okay, this department will use all components, but for this department, we will only have, uh, for example, VNC Talk and OnCloud, but not the other stuff like the groupware and um, whatever else is there. And so we really needed to uh, click own cloud into place um, there to, to make it um, available in that way. So I'm looking over whether there are any questions so far in the chat. No, no questions um, at the moment. So I think, um, Ben, is there anything else for you um, to mention at this moment or what our next um, steps are or next projects are where we are at yeah so um vnc we, we're just uh we, we've got to the point now where we can we can deploy very quickly um our, our whole suite so uh the, the the future is to continue to roll out and incrementally um deliver and iterate over what we have and improve on it um but as for the questions yeah um it, it's just you know, use use the the chart. Uh, let us know any feedback. Raise issues on on GitHub if there are any. But um, yeah, come back to us. We're we're really interested and uh, quite proud of this one. So nothing more to add. 
Yeah, very cool. And just for you to know, this is all um, due to our great DevOps team, where uh, Ben is a vital part of, <laughs> that has, um, you know, some years ago, this was not even an issue having uh, de development operations. Um, then it was on a development on the one side and um, operations or systems administration on the other. But nowadays, you really need to have everything integrated because um, what we would we do without um, having uh, uh, you know testing our software having uh, we have a software factory where we roll out with automated tests and then uh, the deployments so everything needs to be uh, modularized and flexible and um, I will show you here um, you can see the layers that we have on our VNC Lagoon platform. And what is very important for us is um, on the uh, platform or the infrastructure layer down here, it doesn't matter at all where our customers want to or our partners want to place their infrastructure, whether it's in the US, in Europe or in Asia, where, whether it's in secured private um, data centers or on-premise or whether it's uh, on the Google Cloud or AWS or wherever. Um, we are uh, infrastructure agnostic, so to say, on the platform side, that's the second layer, um, that is um, the platform and all our backend systems. And of course, we are deploying um, with um, via Kubernetes there. We have our complete API framework there. So you get um, interfaces for nearly everything that makes it also easy for us to uh, integrate uh, third party products or other solutions as we are doing <clears throat> with own cloud or have already done. And um, in the back end, we also have our uh, middleware components that are also used for provisioning and for um, uh, yeah, uh, permission management or di directory service that also can be integrated with other directory services that you might have in place like Active Directory or LDAP or whatever and our application exchange framework because our applications are not only integrated uh, in a front end way, but on the back end, and therefore, for example, indexing um, uh, 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 routines that are running through. So that's the platform. And on the software as a service <laughs> or not as a service, so you know, we are not a SaaS provider. We have all our different applications running on the infrastructure and the platform of um, the customers. Um, needs and uh, wishes and all our products they run um, either in a browser um, or uh, on the desktop we have desktop clients for windows mac and linux or as apps uh, mobile apps on android and ios so also here we have flexibility as our um, really major goal and um, test it out vnc lagoon live is um, there for you and um, can be tested out anytime. So I think, um, Ben, we should wrap up. I'm having a, another look at uh, the chat, whether there are questions, not so far. So I think um, this is it about Helm charts. Please go to um, um, the GitHub and um, ask the questions there or get back to us. We'd be happy to answer them. Thank you, Ben. <laughs> Thank you very much, Andrea.